MPNs are a group of hematological disorders that are now considered and classified as neoplasia. This is in the revised WHO classification. And of course, this does not change the true nature of these disorders compared to the previous WHO classification. But naming these in that way is very important to understand their pathogenesis. The original four classical myeloproliferative neoplasms were polycythemia rubrivira, essential thrombocythemia and idiopathic myelofibrosis together with chronic myeloid leukemia. Chronic myeloid leukemia since the discovery of the Philadelphia chromosome is typically thought of as something separate from the other MPNs at present. And then in addition to those four classical MPNs, there's a whole mishmash of other things, including myeloproliferative dysplastic overlap syndromes like RARS with thrombocytosis, um, chronic myelomonocytic leukemia, the um, recently well-characterized chronic eosinophilic leukemias, and then other conditions such as systemic mastocytosis. So it's quite a large group of diseases, and really all that they have in common is proliferation of a myeloid lineage. Um, with maturation as opposed to acute leukemia.